Yo, what's happening guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Void Hero Minecraft map. If you want to check this out, the link is in description. You can go ahead and play this also. Uh, and also, if you've missed any episodes, you can go back and check out the playlist and you can get yourself caught up on the ones that you have not yet seen. Uh, so right off the rip here, let's go ahead and get some people added to the member zone. We don't have any new commenters. Um, so if you want to get added, there is a separate zone over here, the uh, comment garden. If you drop a good comment, a suggestion, uh, maybe just a nice comment, something that I like, I will look at them and I will pick you and add you to the uh, comment garden. But anyways, we have members to add, so let's go ahead and add in. Today we're actually going to do a duo of members. Today we're going to add in Destiny and Patrick. Both have been members for a year. Uh, greatly appreciated. Uh, it helps support the channel a bunch. So if you would like to possibly get added to the member zone, it's only 99 cents to become a member, but that gets you a bunch of cool perks. You get access to a 24-7 cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server, which starting very soon, as soon as Minecraft 1.21 comes out, I think in June here, we are going to be playing season three of that server. So a brand new world, brand new stuff. It's going to be the best version of the server, I think, yet because we're gonna have all kinds of custom stuff going on. We're gonna have like claim land, we're gonna have like TPAs, we're gonna have warps, we're gonna have um, possibly a PVP zone. There's gonna be all kind of crazy stuff going on. We, we got lots of plans, so definitely something to look into if uh, you wanna help support the channel and drop just 99 cents a month to uh, get some cool perks like that. And if you're interested, another way of uh, supporting the channel is checking out merch. This nice hat I got going on here and this sweet shirt we got going on here, you can get all of this stuff at the store. Link in the description, link on the channel. So check that stuff out if that's something you'd be interested in also. Uh, but anyways, as for today, it's been a little while since I've done an episode of this. I did, um, two weeks ago, I did a live streamed episode, but I'm trying to figure out what it is. We can always check the achievements and see... Uh, what there is for me to do going forward. So it says that you get a dark fragment from a cave and it, uh, we can make an ancient city. So that would be kind of cool. Also, I don't know how you're going to get a pillager outpost. Bastion, I'm kind of... Oh, an enormous fortress. I, did we get a fortress one? I have a feeling we got a fortress one last time. We've not gotten a fortress one. And I have a feeling that that's going to come from uh, taking out the piglin brute. So I think today we should start out by throwing some nether fragments and see if we can get the piglin brute taken out. I need to have some blocks on hand. That's always my mistake. I don't have blocks on me. And so I fudge up and uh, I don't get uh, up in the air to avoid the the hits. So we're going to we're gonna actually take blocks with me this time. I'm going to give this a try. And you know, I was trying to figure out what is more efficient if you make the bamboo into blocks and then into sticks or if you just make it into sticks and it turns out it's exactly the same either way. So I don't need to waste time going through the process of making it into blocks and then sticks. If I'm gonna trade it, I can just take the bamboo and make it right into sticks. Should I make an attempt on this enderman? Might be a good idea. Actually, I don't really need the ender pro, oh. Well, he's doing good. There, here he comes. Uh, I don't really need the ender pearls because, you know, I'm, uh, I got the trader for it, but he does drop a fragment, doesn't he? He didn't drop a fragment that time. He did drop an ender pearl, though. Yeah, I think I already traded all, because I have down in the uh, igloo here, I have a trader who can uh, trade me up all of the good old ender pearls that I will ever need. Oh, I'm not wearing gold, am I? I'm not. These guys are going to be mad at me. Fudge, I have to run home. <laughs> All right, I got my sick golden boots on. We're ready to go again. Oh, that makes him mad, doesn't it? I shouldn't open chests. He, he kind of just ignored that, though. Um, but anyways, we're here. I'm kind of curious why he just ignored that. He must have uh, bigger fish to fry, I guess. So I'm going to take some of these blocks, and I'm going to use these to build out a platform where we're going to throw the, uh, the fragments. All right, so let's give this a try, and I need to be prepared. I need to be prepared to build up if it gets... Okay, we're good, we're good, we're chilling. Just one of these zones. You can also grab some more of this. I do like this as like a building block too. But it also will work right here for like, you know, kind of just building out a little bit more where we can throw another fragment. I do hear gas and that's not a, that's not a good sign. 
Oh yeah, we have gas spawning in. That's real bad. Ooh, that was a nice shot. We hit another nice sick shot like that. Oh, yeah, he's floating away. I don't I don't like that. He's floating towards my house. That's a bad sign. But uh, anyways, let's try another. I need to get more of these nether fragments. I'm actually kind of running short. Oh, oh, I I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. Oh god. What have I done? <laughs> I didn't mean it, buddy. My bad. Oh, that's lava. But there might be a uh, netherrack in there. Or not netherrack, um, what do you call it? Uh, netherite. I think, yeah, I probably should be checking these a little better. Fudge, I'm on fire. Is that, is that just blackstone or is that, is that actually nether, uh, netherite there? Oh, we do have netherite. For yeah. Come on, stop being on fire already. Yeah, we're, we're gonna get netherite up. We're gonna be fully stacked netherite before we even face the dragon, whatever that looks like. We're still kind of curious how that's gonna go. I don't want to mine gold, I don't think, because they're uh, possibly gonna be mad at me. These uh, these guys who are chilling over here. Is he already mad at me? No, he's he's running from something, but it's not me. Oh, it's the pig, the uh, zombie ones. I see. All right, so another piece of uh, ancient debris. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Let's try another. Ooh. This is good. Nice. Did I get a skull? I did not get a skull. Did he uh, drop a blazy rod for me? He did not. You dingus. You're supposed to drop a blazy rod for me. But we do have a chest. You need to, like, get out of my freaking face, my dude. He's gonna be mad about that. He's gonna be mad about that. God dang it. I've gotten the wrath of the... Oh, wait. That drops, uh... Nether fragments, though. So I guess not not a bad thing. Ooh, we did get a skull. Another saddle. I don't think I need a saddle. I don't need... I mean, wh where am I riding a horse? We don't have, like, massive open fields to ride a horse. Should probably give this a little light, too. We do need more of these to spawn in. Uh, unless we get the uh, fortress fragment. If that's the case, then we can uh, spawn in a fortress. And I should have a blaze spawner, I think, in that. And I should be able to take out blazes that way. But, uh... It's kind of the only thing holding me up from going to the end at this point. Ooh, what the heck? Soul Sand? Soul Sand Valley? Frig off? Frig off with you? This is the worst biome, so we're gonna get rid of this. Let's go ahead and just throw another one right on top of this. Just frig this. Ooh, that's a weird little combo wombo we got going on. Alright, I'm gonna build out a little bit more over this way. We're gonna try and go ahead and throw another without losing it. I'm down to three. We're still not having much progress on getting one of the brutes to spawn in. Uh, after this, we can go try and throw some cave ones and see about... Uh, yeah, we throw... Whoa. He mad. He mad. Why you mad? Why you mad? Why are you here? All right, I need to throw some crap out. All right, anyways. Uh, back to throwing. I can get more of these easy enough, but we could also try some ca cave fragments because there I should get an ancient city fragment. I don't know how that's going to work out, but it's supposed to, so... Another one of these zones. Oh no, another pig. He mad, why he mad? I'm gonna need some blue mushrooms on me. He's gonna knock me off of here. What the frig? Well, we're picking up a little bit of uh, a little bit of pork here, so that's that's all right, I guess. I'm just gonna try and fill in the gaps here a little bit. Oh, let's, um, oh fudge, you dingus. You dingus pig. Get lost. Oh, my freaking sword's gonna break too. I don't, do I have a backup? I do. Come on, frig off. Ooh, he dropped something. What did he drop? Bastion fragment. Throw the fragment to restore a small part of the world. Oh, that's actually a good one. Okay, so let's go ahead and throw uh, these last two nether fragments, and then we can try out a bastion fragment. Did I check this? Yeah, I checked that. We're good. We're chilling. Oh, but they mad. Oh, fudge, where did you come from? Where did... What? What the frig? Why are you mad? Oh, it's because I opened the chest. I forget about the chest thing. No, you. Why are you mad? Why would the zombie be mad that I ki that I killed one of the regular piglins? Jake to me didn't want to live in the same world as a zombified piglin. No, I didn't. Not at all. You hate to see it. There's a lot of gas spawning in, and I'm really not a fan of that, especially walking down this little thin line here. Oh, that was almost a sick hit. Come on, let's get a sick hit. 
Let's get it. He's flying too far away. I'm getting close. Come on. That's got to do it. Oh, that was so close. He's going to frig up my platform here, isn't he? Come on. Oh, that, that should have done it. That was a second shot. Why did that not do it? Nice. There we go. There we freaking go. I wonder if they drop any kind of fragments. Be uh, a good thing to look into, I guess. God dang it. We're getting so many of these guys. Do I have blue mushrooms around me? I threw out blue mushrooms. I shouldn't have done that. I hadn't thought about how annoying these guys would get. They're afraid of something over here. Fall off. You need to fall off. Ah, uh, the little one too? Frig, dude. So dangerous. Good god, man. Did they just push me to safety? I think they did. Oh, that's why we're getting so many freaking gas spotting in. That gives me a deep fragment. Okay, those are those are alright, right? Let's give this a try. I'm up here on the safety platform. We can try that out. Maybe we'll uh, maybe we'll end up getting one of the ones that I want to get to fight the um, the brute, and we'll be in like a little bit of a safety zone. Let me block this up so nobody can get up here. These guys are so annoying. They're all in the way all the time. All right, whatever. Nope, oh, that's what you get. You guys are being dinguses. Oh, I thought I was about to fall into the void. We can get another bit of uh, scrap here, I think, though. This is one of the scrappy zones. It's always surrounded by lava. I think that's on purpose. Yeah, completely surrounded by lava. That's got to be on purpose, right? There's so much stuff spawning in, it's getting so annoying. That was the last one. Uh, I don't think I got... Oh, I did get it back. Okay, nice. And this one has a freaking hole in the middle. All right, one more. But then we do have the uh, the Bastion one, so we can always throw that and see what we get out of that. All right, let's see what's going to happen here. Oh, we got it. That's the one I wanted. Oh, and he's got away over here. Oh, no. Everybody's mad. Everybody's mad. No, this is not what I wanted. Oh. God dang it, dude. It's never going to work. But the good thing is... Cause why did the... <clears throat> I didn't know that was a thing. That zombified piglins also get mad when you hit... Um, one of the regular piglins? That doesn't even make any sense, to be honest. Why would that even be a thing? But uh, anyways, we failed on taking out the brute once again. But I do have the bastion fragment, so we're going to throw that. We're going to create a bastion, and uh, perhaps we'll get some good stuff out of that. Ooh, how did I miss this? We got a little bit of debris here. Is that going to be... That's going to be probably... Because I think I have one at home. That should be enough to make myself a bit of netherite gear. Also, I think I have one netherite um, ingot already, so we're kind of, I think we're kind of able to do that now. All right, but anyways, I'm going to go ahead and build out a big platform up here, and we're going to go ahead, and we're going to throw the next uh, fragment, that bastion fragment. We're going to see what happens out of that. Well, I guess, uh, oh wait, hold on a second. It did have a, uh, needs to be at Y70. Okay, okay. So... We are currently at negative 31. Okay, so good thing I checked because we need to build our way up a bit. Quite a bit. So I'm going to gather some more resources, I suppose, and we'll uh, we'll go ahead and build our way up. I've created such a dangerous zone here, dude. There is just so much spawnage. It is freaking ridiculous. And these pigs, man, especially the little ones. So like, why are you attacking me? What did I ever do to the little pig? I guess maybe take out the parent pig, maybe? Maybe that's why they're mad? I don't know. I don't freaking know. All right, so time to build a staircase, I suppose. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Why? Freaking gas, man. God dang it. What the fudge? Why does it have to be gas? Hopefully he's, uh, despawn? Is he, is he despawn? Uh, hopefully I can get far enough away also, so that way, like, he's not gonna frig me up again. Because, of course, he's gotta be a ghast who can destroy my freaking platform I'm trying to build and knock me into the void. Couldn't be anybody else. I'm gonna grab some more of this stuff though while we're while we're at it here. I love the fact that there's wood in the nether. It was a pretty sick update. It kind of made the nether like really a lot harder. It's a lot harder to find fortresses now, but it did 
add in some pretty cool stuff with the new biomes and the new uh, mobs and stuff. But uh, anyways, let's get back to it. It's crazy. I didn't realize like in the beginning how low down everything. I never checked my. Uh, I never did F3. It's like I never realized how low everything was in my entire island here. And I wonder if that's on purpose or or not. Like if it's random every time. Alrighty, we've arrived at Y70, and I've gone home, got myself a bunch of random blocks. So time to build the uh, the good old random platform. I always seem to just be building platforms out of just random junk that I find because it helps clear it out of the chest. You know, it's it's always a good thing to to clear out your chest of all that random junk. All right, let's give this a try. Let's stand back here and uh, let's watch the magic happen. Oh, that went flying, dude. That went zooming. Holy crap, and it just spawned. Whoa. Okay, so I threw the thing over here, and yet somehow it, sp it spawned over here, and uh, it definitely, f like, these fragments are kind of bonkers. Like, sometimes you throw them, and they just go way off course, like, out the park. Now here, I gotta be very careful. We have a lot of these piglin brutes here, and uh, they're not gonna be very happy with me. Especially not when I loot their chest that I see right over there. So I need to be, I need to be ready to build up so I can just kind of take them out. Let's uh, maybe let's try and get their attention. What if I uh, build up myself a little bit of a platform here? Shoot him, shoot him with a bow. Okay, that guy's mad. He's a bowman. We don't want him coming in. Okay, we need to somehow take the bowman out. Before he shoots me off the platform. Okay, I took one of the brutes out, but I don't think that it... Okay, we got... Fudge. That's not good. That's not good. Oh, that's not good. Okay, we're good. We're, we're chilling. We're safe. We're safe. <laughs> These guys do not have bows. So, we can maybe break down one block, and then they can't hit me, right? Nope, they can hit me. Fudge. That's not good. That's not good. Okay, looks like the bow is the method. Oh, nice. We took him out. We got another bashing fragment, so I don't think that it was the most useful thing taking out the uh, the brute. You know what I mean? I don't think it made that much of a difference. <clears throat> we got some, uh, yes, yeah, nether fragments. I think we got a bashing fragment. I'm going to I'm gonna kind of close myself off in here and chill for a little bit if I can, if that's possible at all. And we're going to grab some chest stuff. Also, was this not uh, an advancement? Did I not get an advancement for this? Let's see. Oh, here we go. Okay, so create a bastion and then uh, obtain a netherite, uh, or an upgrade fragment for netherite, which I should maybe have one in here. No, it doesn't look like it. Got some iron though, that's pretty good. I'm just gonna try and gather up a bit of blocks here because I'm gonna have to do this with all the chests. Otherwise you end up in a bad situation. We'll go ahead and uh, leave that there like that with that um, torch on it so we know it's been looted. Need to be careful here. Oh, hey, there we go. Got some more nether fragments. So that's always good. But I think we're basically going to be knocking the uh, nether stuff out today, except for we don't have... Oh, nice. Ancient debris. Soul speed boots. Not the most interesting. The only thing we're not going to have... Oh, here we go. That's what we're looking for. Bam. That's it. We still need the fortress, so somehow I need to create an enormous fortress, which I don't know how I get those fragments yet. But we've knocked out like the uh, piglin kind of stuff, so we should be kind of chilling now. Oh, my man, he's going to be mad, isn't he? I was just in a chest. You need to, like, leave me alone for a minute here. I need to be left alone with this chest for no, uh, no particular reason. No, you need to back off. You need to frig off. And leave me alone with this chest. All right, I'm left. I'm left alone with the chest. Oh, sharpness for uh, iron sword. That's kind of cool. Nice. We're, we got a couple more debris. I need to get more diamonds. Yeah, I definitely need to get more diamonds. Cause uh, how am I gonna how am I gonna duplicate these if I don't have a large amount of diamonds? Or right, well, anyways, I'm sure there's more loot in here, probably down farther. But I don't know if I even want to risk it. I think I might just want to head my way back home. So we also need to work on finding out how we get the uh, ancient city fragments, don't we? This really frigged up my... St I built this nice staircase, and it just completely frigged it. I guess I could redig it like this. And we're going to have some stop-offs here. 
Yeah, I suppose I see why it wants you to uh, do it at 70 because it, it goes down quite a ways. So if you did it at a low uh, a low Y value, then it wouldn't have any room to like generate and it would probably frig it up pretty bad. Hey, there we go. I've uh, fixed my staircase. Very nice. So this platform's kind of useless, I guess, but uh, oh well. Let's check my uh, diamond supply here. Oh, I do have a block of diamond, so that's that's kind of good. Let's get some of this ancient debris uh, smelting on up. Another thing I haven't done yet, let's go ahead and do this real quick. It shouldn't take long. We need to make Ross's, um, he wanted me to make the auto smelter, and I haven't done that yet. We need to do that. Let me just do a light bit of inventory sorting here. All right, so we need a bit of iron, which is not a problem now. I've actually got a stack in 33, so we need to make a few hoppers. Uh, I am going to need some wood for this also. Do I have any anything laying around like that? I got some bamboo. Should be producing some more uh, bamboo over here anyway. So I should need three hoppers. So we need enough wood to make three chests. So that is definitely not enough. I definitely need to kind of like AFK and let this thing produce for a bit. Um, so that way I get a decent bit of bamboo. But anyways, let's, uh, I got some wood now, so we can make, okay, we can make enough chests. Bam, three chests, and then we need three hoppers. Two, three. Uh, you know, I should make sure I don't have, I, because I might have made extras, didn't I? You know, I don't think that I did. Let's just go ahead and make three. We got plenty of iron anyway, like I said. One, two, three of those. We're going to take this. Uh, I don't think I'm going to upgrade it. No, we need this to be, I guess that could have stayed there. And we can build this around it. Yeah, that could stay there because then, well, no, we're going to want it up a bit because the chest is going to want to be here, I think. So we're going to want it there. We're going to want another chest. I guess I'll make a single chest for now. We can always double it later. But we're going to want this hopper going into this chest. We're going to want this hopper going into there. We're going to want this hopper going into there. So we'll go ahead and throw our ores into here, like so. They'll filter into here, and uh, coal can go into there. That'll filter into there, and then it's smelting automatically. Very nice. I had a whole bunch of chests in here. I should have known, because I break the chest a lot of times when I get the grave, uh, the grave fragments. God dang it. Always waste, wasting resources. Now the next order of business, let's make these back into diamonds. So we've got that advancement, right? Yeah. And so then we can go ahead. Like, what do we need? Do we need netherrack to duplicate this? I think we might need netherrack. So I'm, I don't know if I have any. Yeah, I think I cleared all the netherrack I had out. So let's go grab a bit of netherrack. So I should be able to duplicate that. We can do one duplication. So now I can make one bit of netherite gear. And I'm thinking maybe a piece of armor. I also do need to make the smithing table. And that is uh, iron and wood. Okay. There we go. Bam. Smithing table. Very nice. We can throw that next to the crafting table. It looks looks good together. You know, our, our little work area here. It's coming together. Yeah, my pickaxe is kind of close to breaking. I need to get more diamonds. Uh, it's definitely going to be a big thing. I don't remember. Where did I actually get most of my diamonds from? Was it coming from the f fortress? Or not the fortress. I mean the uh, sand, sand temple. Whatever the heck you want to call it. Just look at all that netherite scrap we've got now. I definitely need to up my diamond production. Okay, that's two two ingots. Okay, so we can make we can make a couple things, but I just don't have the diamonds for that. I mean, I could turn this, but it'd be kind of a waste because that's nearly broken. And I still need the diamonds to be able to duplicate the template. So, yeah, I don't know. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to figure out a way to get diamonds. I'll have to do that off camera. I'll have to get on here. Kind of AFK, let bamboo produce. I'll have to uh, start mining for more diamonds. I'm trying to remember where the frig they were coming from. I'll have to go back. Maybe I'll go back and watch some uh, other episodes and see where I was getting all them diamonds from. Uh, but anyways, I can let's make my pants into netherite. Bam, netherite leggings. That's going to be a little bit more uh, armor toughness and knockback resistance. Very nice. Getting a little bit, a little bit more protection here. I think as far as trading for... Uh, diamond gear. I think this guy's gonna be a pretty good option. I think I can trade this guy up and he's gonna trade me. He might just trade me a diamond axe though, which could be a bummer. And see this guy, he's almost maxed out. He's trading pants and uh, pants and boots. I don't know if he's gonna get any more um, armor pieces. I don't know. He should, right? Because he's he's got one more level to go, so he might get another armor piece. I don't know. I don't know how that works actually. But we might be able to get some more, like maybe a full diamond set from that guy of uh, armor. That would be kind of sick. 
Uh, but anyways, that just about does it for today's episode of Void Hero Map. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button down below. That helps me out a bunch. Subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications. So that way you don't miss out on any of the future streams or videos. Join the Discord so you can come by and chat. And uh, like always, if you want to help support, it's only 99 cents here on YouTube, and that gets you a bunch of cool perks, such as access to a 24-7 cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server. Starting Season 3, coming in June. Can't wait for that. Gonna be a lot of good things going on. You also get emojis you can use in chat and on comments and stuff like that. You'll get uh, videos early. As soon as I upload videos, you'll be able to see them too. That's another perk of the membership. But uh, anyways, guys, thanks again for watching. Hopefully, we'll see you in the next one. Peace.